Hello everyone, strip again. Today I'm gonna be doing a new, I'm gonna be doing a new, new reaction, doing a reaction bill. And today I'm gonna be reacting to a corrupt AI, AI one two five, or corrupt Al one two five. And the film is I'm gonna be reacting to. It was just something that he uploaded yesterday. I leave it on. I leave it on. Yeah, I think it was. Yeah. So, yeah, the video of this I'm going to react to is called Review Undo Fruitcake Fruit Cake Soda. Hmm. So, yeah, I'm going to react to it. So, before I even start, I want to give a disclaimer here. If you do not like the content I make, the reaction fills, or any of the other stuff I do on my channel, if you don't like them, then don't watch anything else or else. Because the only thing you're doing is give me a view, and that's a damn truth, or one. That's a damn truth, and not quite the truth. So, yeah. So, now, Bob Birdie, let's get to the video. Right now, let's get it right now. Today, we're going to try Mountain Dew Fruit Quake, which they call because it's supposed to have a blast of artificial fruit cake hmm. flavor. So, I guess Fruit Quake is what they went with. You know, nice Mountain Dew art as usual. Um, I finally found this at Dollar General. This has been out for probably, I don't know, three weeks, maybe a month. Um, but I have not been able to find it. I finally just found it today while I was at Dollar General just buying huh. coffee creamer. Uh, found the Mountain Dew Fruit Quake. So I'm assuming this will be around through December because it's a fruitcake hmm. flavor, kind of a holiday kind of thing. I hope I'll be and I'm extremely find interested that, in it. I, I like all of Mountain Dew's flavors pretty much, um, better than the regular Mountain Dew for sure. So I can do um, and this is very interesting top. to me, even though I'm not like a fruitcake person. I don't like hmm. get fruitcakes during Christmas hmm. really. I mean, I've had them before, but it's not something I go out of my way for. It's not like a tradition for me. So hmm. let's open this up. And it came right out of the fridge too, which is nice of them. Yeah. So let's open it up and take a sip. First thing I want to say is I'm sorry for the AC in the background. It's being mm, really loud and yeah, obnoxious right now, okay. but even though it's November, it's still hot enough to require an AC mm. in Texas. So good on that. Huh. Um, now onto the fruit quake, which I must say, I, I haven't had a fruit cake in a few years, if I'm mm. going to be honest. Um, because like I said, it's not like a family tradition really. And you know, when I'm on my own, I'm not going to order a fruit cake. Um, but it does, it, to me, it tastes very, very spot on for a fruit cake. Um, at least the kind of fruit cakes I would get here um, in the U.S., where it's it's very uh, it's it's kind of it's got a it's got a light nut nutty flavor, um, nutty flavor. It's got a light nutty flavor, and then the fruit kind of comes in on the back end, and it's it's surprisingly delicious and also surprisingly mm. spot on. Um, my only problem with it really is that there's more. I think this is the most Mountain Dew forward of the Mountain Dew flavors I think I've had in a while. It tastes like the first taste you really get is regular Mountain Dew. Hmm. Um, usually when they make them other Mountain Dew flavors, I kind of can't taste the Mountain Dew in it too much. Usually the flavor yeah. dominates it. But this one, it kind of feels like it's due forward and the fruitcake is more of a, more of an aftertaste most of the time, which is not necessarily an issue, but it is huh. something that kind of throws me off a little bit. I do huh. think that for making a fruitcake flavored soda, they pretty much nailed it. Um, maybe they could have done a little less of the Mountain Dew flavor. Maybe they could have adjusted the ratio a little bit. But mm. it's not far off, and I really do like it. But I, I just cannot, I can't give it a five because I don't think I would ever get it again, even though mm. it, it is good. And it does, you know, it does kind of taste like a fruitcake, but I really don't, I'm really not looking for that fruitcake flavor, if that makes sense. Like I said, it's not nostalgic for me. It's not a tradition. It's just something that's there. I mean, I'll have a piece of fruitcake. If yeah. somebody has it, or I'm at like somebody's house and they have fruitcake, fine. Um, it's good, but it's just not something I'm going to go out of my way for, and it's not something I go out of my way for in a Mountain Dew form either. It's great. It, it does taste like fruitcake. If you like fruitcake, go ahead and try it. Even if you don't really like fruitcake, it might be worth a shot because it's good, but mm -hmm. it's just very novelty. Um, of course, that's the whole point of making their Mountain Dew fruitcake is that it's a novelty for the season, but unlike some other flavors that have stuck around for a long time, um, this one really feels like it's temporary, and they might bring it back next year for Christmas, but oh, yeah. it's not something you really want to have more than once a year, just like a regular fruitcake, in my opinion. So that's Mountain Dew Fruit Quake. I'm going to give it a solid four. Mm. Super sugary. Uh, mm. This bottle has 144% of my daily sugars, so that's mm. great. And uh, I'll see you all next time. Yeah. So, yeah, that's the end of the video. And I hope you guys like this race, I hope you guys like it. And I hope you guys do like it if you don't.
and I don't care. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and turn those wiki symbols on. Let me tell my blood and share my videos or react to your friends, family, and also if you want to do it, your choice. Because I ain't making you. So yeah, and don't forget to subscribe to Corrupt AI, AI 225 if you're new. Subscribe to this channel if you haven't yet subscribed. If you haven't yet subscribed. Subscribe. And we're on the road to 2K subscribers and maybe 3K subscribers. But right now we're on the road to 2K subscribers right now. 2K right now. So yeah, and that's the end of this reaction well. And I'll see y'all for more banger reaction well to come. And I'll see y'all in the next time. Jeffrey Jordan signing out. And peace out, Sword of Legends. And happy Thanksgiving month. And peace out, everyone.